so much unintentional fan service from Frieden. I don't know. The way that Frieden does fan service is so interesting to me because of all the animes, like I don't see that much gushing over Magical Girls NSFW art on Twitter or like other websites. But like Frieden, it's fucking crazy. I think it has to do with like the the modesty, like the fact that they're all like covered up and like it makes people want to know more, if you know what I mean. But so, if you show everything, there is nothing for the imagination, right? So again, we got more fucking mimic freed and fucking fan service. And where do we leave off? That's right. The most important thing is Denkin and them just found the final boss. Frieden, uh, a clay doll variant. Some monster might be making these. I'm not sure if this is part of the exam or if there's like a, someone else interfering in the exam. But hey, we got to fight Frieden, Frieden right now. I think a way to like counter her is to either throw a Grimora at her because those dolls or those clay things they all retain like the same personality and different traits like that right so if they were to see a mimic or something we should be able to seal it let's begin today's reaction we are bell they gotta fight themselves honestly pretty lucky like we're bell got to fight these three because like let's get real uh, maybe we're bell is super strong but like come on like you didn't get to, you, didn't, you didn't get the fucking shit roll like get fucking freedom you know or even fern denkin freedom fern i'd be terrified of those this is unfair! Why does they can get freedom? Shit roll, dude! It might be 4v1 though. Instead of like 4v4, right? We would have already withdrawn. We're already fucking out. Ain't no way we can do this. I love Denkin's respect for freedom, dude. And honestly, this girl on the left side, I think we're heavily underestimating her. She was popping off last episode. I don't remember her name yet, but goddamn, look out for her. Hello, freedom. Please don't kill us. Is she gonna just like remove limiter? <laughs> Imagine we fucking uppercut her. Spiegel. Spiegel. Lord of the dungeon. The thing that created the replicas. Okay, okay. If it's a mythical era, I don't know how far back, but was Frieden around back then? So would Frieden maybe be aware of this thing? Maybe she already encountered it before. How old? How old is this? Spiegel. That girl looks like Farron Dune. I don't know why. Oh, it's the fucking long purple hair. That's why. Abilities, mana, skills, everything. So Frieden has all the mana that OG Frieden has. Oh god, here she goes. Run. Run. Ooh. I'm surprised everyone dodged it quite well. Thought there'd be one casualty already. We get the fuck out and find a different entrance. I don't like this. No, fuck fighting freedom, dude. Fight someone else. You, Bell. Does that guy have a cut on his chest? Yo, are you okay? Bro? Alright, land. You, Bell, and land. It's like you die if you stop talking. Would she? What do you mean? You would die if you stop talking? Why? It is kind of weird how it's just like around the corner not doing anything. Gotcha. So you bell copy. Got a quick attack on it. Open it. I dare you. What would happen? What would happen if the other you bell replica like broke the golem, right? The golem would come out. Would it take the replica and get the fuck out of the dungeon? Then we don't have to fight it anymore. Because it's out. Is this the way that we beat these things? <laughs> Make them fucking break the golem? Wouldn't that be hilarious? <laughs> because it has her personality. Makes sense, right? And he's actually bleeding out though. Cause she's still trying to like empathize with Land so that she can take his powers, right? True, cause he always is so safe. He's so cautious. Where's the real copy? Where's the real copy? Really? You would give that away? Is this a ship? I can't tell if this is a ship or not. Really? Alright. Here goes you, Bell. Because both sides can use the seal, right? <laughs> oh, oh, oh. This is oddly kind of tense. Like the sexual tension while she was on top of her. 
herself, actually. Oh. The seal! The seal! But if your luck sucks, but if your luck sucks, wouldn't the replica's luck also just suck? You know what I mean? Ah, shit. Never mind. Wait! What do you mean? What do you mean? <gasps> Land! Ah, oh, you gotta keep looking! That was pretty good teamwork. Was that the real one then? The bottle was fake. Land is so fucking cautious. Bro's fucking bottle was fake too? And we risked our life to get it for him? Hey. You Where are you? We're never gonna. This is probably not a real one either, dude. Because she, he felt bad. If he deceived her and she gave away the real one, meaning he cares. That's right. Ready, perfect. Gonna be okay. She wasn't even thinking about like beating herself. Like she was, but that wasn't priority. Like she was setting up all these different things to set up land. What the fuck? Yo, you both kind of next level, huh? Is she closer to empathizing with him? So that she can get his skills? Not yet. This is straight up a fucking rom com, dude. Straight up. This is just a rom com between these two. Like, if, like, a rom com should take this kind of like formula. Like, a girl that's like trying so hard to get to a guy because she wants to empathize for her own gains. Like, romance is not really on the table. And a guy that's just like being pro distance and cold, you know? I feel like this is straight up a rom com here. It's kind of good. It's a nice ship. Okay, Friden, Fern Party. Yo. What ha- Would the mythical monster create a replica of Sensei? Or what, what's her name? I, I, I keep getting the naming difference. There's Seide and there's Sensei, right? I'm not sure which one this one is, but like, cause you know, right? Okay, Sensei. Uh, okay, okay, no spoilers, no spoilers. All right, all right, all right, all right. Uh-oh, there might be a stronger opponent. Oh, I don't know if Sensei's strong. Sensei's probably stronger than Farin, but not Frieden, right? <gasps> <gasps> oh, maybe a mimic's in there. She's so excited. Yeah, for sure. And my next pull in Honkai Star Rail is gonna be Black Swan, and I'm not gonna lose a 50 50. <laughs> More freedom fan service. Oh! Found it! Is it a trap though, or is it a secret room? Uh, why are the statues moving? Yo, this is not solo leveling. What's going on? Okay, it's a hidden entrance. I thought they're gonna statue that's not gonna attacking us. The smell of adventure awaits us. <laughs> Dude, who maintains these candles? Like, I know that you don't have to worry about these things, but sometimes my brain just like wonders. It's like, alright, this is a fucking labyrinth. Is there a fucking janitor here that like maintains all these candles and shit? You're telling me they're just candles lit all fucking year long? Like, what? Achievements of the king is buried here? Treasures? Oh, this is like a super secret room. Actually valuable discovery. This is a dub. She was right. Well, it's not maybe what she wanted to see, but... Yeah, Frida was low-key disappointed there until she saw Farron smile. Farron smiling is very rare. She likes this. Just knowing about history and different stuff. I guess it's like a sense of adventure. But yeah, Frida low-key was like, fuck, no grimoire. And then she looked at Fern, smile, and she's like, all right, that's, that's kind of nice. Don't jinx it now. Don't jinx it now. Oh, thank you, Fern! Smart. Smart though. This is that way she would have done, right? Because if you're in there, you're probably gonna die. They literally just went out. They went, oops. I'm out. Well, what kind of boss room lets you escape like that? A reasonable boss room. So maybe we all fucking team up and we go against Frieden. Hello, thank you. So this, there's no other way around it. You have to get through this door? That thing. <laughs> let's peek in there. <laughs> Uh-oh. Uh-oh. She's pretty excited about it, though. What's she gonna do, though, to beat herself? Throw a grimoire. I don't know. Mimics. Something. Nah, we gotta think outside the box. We gotta think outside the box. And maybe outside the box is actually inside the box. And the box is a mimic. Oh, okay. Her name is Method. <laughs> cool name. Ooh. <laughs> she, she got so big all of a sudden. You know, you know that one meme of a uh, fuck. I forgot the actor's name. I think he does the Green Goblin dude. He's like looking up. He's like, <laughs> yeah. okay. What? Oh, oh, hey, oh. Thank you. A mommy hug. I mean, this is a mommy hugging a granny though. Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> she, <laughs> she fucking. 
<laughs> She's like, oh, this is nice. You smell nice. Oh, so nice. <laughs> and the fur is like pouting. Oh, for sure. Yeah, look me in my eyes. Yeah, look, look me in the eyes. Come on, baby. What do you see? Oh, she's trying to hypnotize us there? You can hypnotize me. You can penetrate me too. Okay, Fern. Okay, okay, okay. Got a little jealous there. Look at this shit. Look, at, look how protective Fern is of, of her child. Because Fern is the mom, right? Old? Well, yeah. She's a fucking boomer. Because she's so old that like modern stuff doesn't work. Adel. Who the fuck is Adel, dude? Probably one of her own party before, right? The people she was with. Damn, Fern's still hugging her. I think Fern is very intimidated by Method. She's still holding the power, dude. Holy shit. I need to focus on the subtitles, but I keep looking at Fern's power. Okay, Baldi's party. That's Adel. Okay. Who are they fighting? Zenzei? <gasps> oh, they... I, I, I don't know. What's a worse role? Zenzei or Freiren? Um, Freedom's probably stronger, right? Freedom's probably stronger, right? I'm gonna just assume Freedom is better. Maybe I'm underestimating Zenzei, but it's Freedom. You know, it's the legendary fucking elf that took down the fucking Demon King, you know? But Zenzei is a first class mage, so, you know? This is a pretty bad role here, too. Bald. 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 His name shouldn't be Bly, it should be Bald. Edel. Right. Mustachio, Bald, and Edel. What? Modern magic is bad for this dungeon? Right, they talked about the mechanics before, but like how, you know, Farron and Freedom, we always use just very simple ones. That's all you need. What is Zenzei's power? Something hair related. Run away, escape. Meet up with Freedom's party. Am I underestimating this? <laughs> wait, wait, wait. Why did you just talk about how amazing it is that she could control each fight, like hair? And then you like go immediately into Baldi and Baldi's looking down at me like... <laughs> cameraman, the cameraman timing there, the comedic timing was fucking amazing. You did not have to shit on Baldi like that, but basically, uh, Zenzei's ability to control... Each single hair, right? Because there's a lot of different hair. Not on Baldi, but, you know, other people. So to be able to control each single individual hair like that. That's fucking insane. Gotcha. Can it even be hypnotized? Yeah, that's another assumption. Uh-oh. Run. What do you mean? Here we go. Damn, so basically the hair is pretty much just like blades. By 15 seconds! Uh, stronger force. That's right. Brute force? Or carefully go around it. So she's trying to brute force it now? Doing both at the same time, never mind. I mean, this is a first class magician replica. Can okay, I talk to it? Talk. No shot, it works. No! No! You did? That was the fucking assumption, right? I. S Cause it's like you have to make eye contact and you have to speak to it. But then the third layer is like, okay, what if she has no mind to hypnotize? Bro, that was cool. She should have won there. She should have won. But the assumption, that one assumption. That's why you never assume, man. You needed to be more cautious. Say it wouldn't have made this mistake. She was not ready perfectly. She was a gonna be okay. <laughs> this is what happens when you go gonna be okay, dude. It's not gonna be okay. Well, the penetrations might not be lethal, actually. Ah, she's good, she's good, she's good, she's good. <laughs> wait, wait, why are you... Okay, I, I thought for a second the golem just like submitted in defeat after realizing, oh shit, it's a Zenze replica. Look, it gets summoned and then it's like, oh, all right, nope, I'm not fighting this shit either, nope.
Nein, jetzt war jetzt Alright, let's get the fuck out of here. Yeah. Very well made. <laughs> Look at that man tongue, dude. Every time. It's just something so hilarious about this golem's motion. It's so big, it's got fucking cake that just fucking runs out. <laughs> bye bye. Lavina and Kane still alive? Amazing. Is this the guy that went in first? Remember the guy? He was like, fuck you, Boomer Denkin. I don't need anybody. I'm gonna go in solo. I'm actually amazed that he didn't die. I, I mean, he looks like he's shit out of luck, right? It seems like he's done, but I mean, he's not dead yet, right? <laughs> right? <laughs> mm. Is Fern the key here? Is Fern gonna be the key to this? What was that stare? Back at uh, Weird Bell's party. I mean, they have no mind, but... Doesn't mean that they don't think, right? I'm not really sure what that means. That they have no mind. They're thinking, right? Does that make sense? If you, can you think without a mind? Why is this a good matchup? Because each one of our team members counters someone else on the other team. They're actually doing it! What? Destroying the roof? Ah, nothing like rubble. Oh, 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 Denki wants to fight. <laughs> Denk, Denk, Denki wants to fight. Yo, let's go in there. You never show me the uppercut, man. Show me the uppercut. Go in there, Denki. Huh? What? I mean, if you think about it, this girl in the beginning, what was the first thing that happened when we met Fern? She was a little kid, and she was on like some kind of cliff, and she was shooting fat lasers against the boulder, right? So like, she's saying that she got the brute force enough to kill Frieden? Yeah? Okay, show me! Frieden looks pretty hyped there. Let's do it? Just buy time for her to charge up. Super attack? Damn it! That cliffhanger got me out of nowhere. But that's the episode. Kind of set up. But we got a little bit more action, right? The uh, the ship between land and Yubel, which is not really romantic because she's just doing this to get his OP skills. But because she needs to empathize, suddenly we have this like interesting rom-com dynamic out of nowhere, right? Honestly, I think it works quite well, even though it's not supposed to be. You know what I mean? We got to know a little bit more about the replicas. We got to see, you know, Denkin's party run the fuck up. Very smart. We're teaming up. Mommy method. That was a good scene where she just hugs you and she Frida's is like hmm this is nice mm. and she like grabbed the fucker too and then Fern got so jealous with the pout dude Fern held this pout for like fucking five minutes like she just sat there just stood there just pouting the entire time you know that's gonna be made into like you know meme pictures uh this party baldy mustachio and Edel. I guess it was good to kind of just they got a bad role right it's fucking Zenze. it's not fair right that's such a bad role to get a fucking first class made replica why couldn't I, why couldn't this be baldy replica you know <laughs> they could have gave us like baldy mustachio replica but we got fucking zenze fucking bullshit dude and she is fucking strong i think the funniest part was the dialogue of how amazing zenze's control over a mana is and the quality and the quantity of it because each individual hair strand is being controlled but then the cameraman immediately pans to baldy it's like, why, cameraman? That is so mean. Then again, I'm the guy that fucking calls every fucking bald character bald. And yes, more golem ass. And yeah, Farron is saying that she is her. Apparently, she can kill Frieden. Does she have a magic? Like the, probably just like the most basic attack, right? But it's going to be like a super charge. So we'll see you next episode. But hey, if you're still here, if you didn't enjoy this reaction, please like the video. Check out the other playlist for more content. And until next time, take care.